And then you were talking about the methanogens um, contributing to body mass. Can you cover that with us for a second? Yeah, so that's a whole other kind of talk, but, I, but I'll summarize it is that, you know, hydrogen producers are the big group in the gut. So they're producing hydrogen. And as Ed mentioned, when the hydrogen level goes up in the gut, it inhibits those bacteria. It's sort of like they're pickling themselves. Uh, and so they can't, they stop. They stop eating and digesting because they're, the, the hydrogen level's too high. And so it kind of contains them. Now the hydrogen producers are eating the lettuce and the salads and the, and the material that humans can't digest, they're digesting them, they're helping get calories out of them. And so if, you're, if you have a lot of hydrogen producers and they're eating all that material and they die and they give you all that nutrient, that gives you more calories. But because the hydrogen producers are self-limited, they kind of like pickle themselves, they do it in a contained way. As Soon as you add the methane, Methane's taking all the hydrogen away, and the hydrogen producers are firing through food much faster, much faster, much faster, and therefore they're liberating more short-chain fatty acids, more calories to you. And we've shown this in a number of studies. The second part of methane is it slows your gut down. More time, more time to absorb, more nutrients, more calories. So the way I kind of summarize it is I say, if you look at the back label of a bottle, and it says 120 calories per serving, if you're methane, it's 130 or 140. It's just you get more calories out of something if you have methane and uh, because the bugs help harness or harvest energy.